Hey guys, it's the Solo Cloth here today, and so this monster analysis video, we're going to be going over Olin, and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not he is worth getting out of his new breeding event, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Olin is an attacker, and his traits are going to be a hardened, blind immunity, and anticipation. And hardened is decent, blind immunity is bad, and anticipation is okay. They're not the best traits, but they are still pretty decent. And then his relics are sword and sword, which are pretty good. And then if we go into his pros and cons, he has two anticipation skills that also boost his damage which is pretty great for an attacker and he can also remove shields before damage which is also really great for an attacker and his only cons are applies only one torture excluding sunburn from special of course and then he has an awful trait besides status caster which yeah that is true then if we go to his leaked movesite he has an aoe 32 water damage with drowned which is pretty decent he has a removed shield with 70 light damage which is quite a bit of damage and it's only one cooldown then he also has a 75 water damage with drown with one cooldown then he's got a 40 light damage with a zero cooldown so he does have very low cooldowns which is really cool and then he has an aoe remove shield with 40 light damage which is a pretty strong aoe move and then he has self anticipation with double damage which is a great move and then he's got the same thing but with damage boost so yeah this monster is very low cooldown so that is very very cool and yeah he's got some really powerful moves with double damage in order to boost them even higher so yeah, this monster will be great for bounty hunts just because of his damage boost, double damage moves. But it'll also be good for normal battles. He's just kind of basic. I mean, he does do a lot of damage, but he doesn't really do anything besides that. He does have Drowned, which is pretty good. He even has an AoE Drowned, which is pretty good. But he only has Drowned. That's all he's got. So yeah, if you don't mind that though, and if you just want an attacker to do a ton of damage, this is the monster for you. Definitely go and try to get him. And since he is in a breeding mate, you should go and try to get him anyway because he is pretty easy to get. And you don't really have to stop what you're doing in order to get him. So yeah, go and get Olin out of his current breeding event. Let me know what you guys think about him in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Over to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.